This is a fun update for HDB flats and how it will affect like condo prices and definitely landed prices as well. Yeah, too many million dollar flats record prices every day. So in just July alone, got 120 million dollar HDB flat, which is like a four a day, man. And now let's talk about the next record price. And this time it's not the normal HDB flats, it's HDB landed. A rare 52 year old HDB terrace sold for 1.33 million because the most expensive three room resale. Leh. You think about that, ah, 52 years old ah, is less than half of a 99 years lease. And imagine if HDB were to sell full lease HDB terrace, ah, it will be double or 2.7 million. But that's leasehold. So do you know that today you can still have the chance to buy a freehold lender at this price? Uh, 2.7 million. Anything below 3 million, I have shared in my last lender video. Go and check out. Then two days later, we have another record price. Another Terrace Breaks 3 room record. And this time 1.568 million. Eh. I believe the leasehold is also about half. Ah. So imagine a full lease 99 years new HDB Terrace. Ah. Times 2, 3.1 million. Oh. So today, can you purchase something at 3.1 million, a freehold landed property? Yes, it's possible, but quite potentially inside got many goals. Ah. Ah! But I don't care got goals. Ah. I call them Casper, a ah, prosperous one. Casper, the friendly Oh yeah, now it's Ghost Festival. Many of the people ask me, oh, should I uh, don't buy anything now due to this festival? I got people who tell me, uh, property prices is scarier than Ghost Festival. Uh, so buy as soon as possible. Uh. I, I mean, there are always transactions within this period. Uh. Doesn't mean that this one month, zero transaction volume. Not possible. Uh. I mean, you may be superstitious. You do not want to buy within this period. Then don't buy this period. Uh. Anyway, you have waited for 20, 30 years not doing anything, not doing for one more month, it's okay. Right? Now let's stop talking about record price. Let's talk about the growth for quarter two for OCR, City Fringe, and Core Region. So I shared many times that if you are a HDB upgrader, EC upgrader, or private property owners who already got one and you want to buy the second property, these are the two areas that I always recommend you to buy. Yes, you are right. Just don't buy that one place can really. So anyway, for this quarter two, uh, we have OCR increased by 0.2%, City Fringe 1.6%, and Core Region negative 0.3%. Yeah, so just buy the two area la. Low risk, risk free. Core Region looks good, but I uh, Core Region looks atas, but the pocket no money one eh. So what kind of person you want to be? You want to look good outside or you want to look good in your pocket. So go and mix with more friends in the City Fish and OCR. If you know any friends who stay in core region, just delete them from Facebook. Especially those people who just bought one. Ah, ha, ha, ha. And of course, the last segment, lender property increased by 1.9%. So the gold medal for quarter two goes to lender property. La. If you have two lender property, then you've got two gold medal. Or... But if your lender property is a 99 years one, la, I, uh, I, I think you, you are not in Olympic. Uh. You are in some uh, neighborhood games. I share freehold lender, freehold lender, freehold lender because when you see they increase, uh, it's insane one. Eh. I, I know many of you love my lender video, so I'm going to touch some lender news over here. So in 2021, three years ago, we have the record price for a GCB land size about 15,000 square feet, sold at 4,291 per square feet, which works out to be 63.7 million. That at that time, it's like, wow, xiao, wow, wow crazy. Ah. Ah. But you must understand, people who buy this, uh, they are all billionaires. So when you convert into the relativity, uh, it's just like a normal salary person buying a condo. Uh. But to them, they, because their income is like insanely high, uh, they buy something like about the same tier. Uh, they buy a GCB. Uh. Remember, this is 63.7 million. And right now, there's a lot of crazy million dollar flats. And recently, we have one GCB that transact about the same size at 6,002 per square feet. 93.9 million. That means the person who bought 3 years ago at 63 million, which is already mind blown. Uh, these 3 years made 30 million eh. 30 million eh. 10 million per year. Uh. So you drop one tier. If you buy a... Bungalow in core region, you make about 
a million per year. I uh, have lah. I experienced before. Okay. Then if you drop one more tier, you may have people who make 100,000 per year, which is a very good start as well. So in summary, you need to learn how to make 10K first. No lah, property can't make, make 10K, ah, minimum 100. Ah, nah. So in property, the good thing, you learn to make 100K first, then proceed to buy a bigger one, maybe a four-wheeler, makes 150K per year. Then a uh, small lender, maybe two, three hundred K per year. Then better lender, one million a year. Then five million a year. Then this is crazy, ten million a year. Lah. I don't know whether I share this, uh, it will inspire you, you know, because it's really workable. But you just need to focus and start your plan and you need to execute your plan now. Hey guys, you have no choice. You need to do now because you are getting cuter and cuter. We are not freehold property. Eh. We are leasehold property. We will die one day one. So yeah, just do la. Dream big. But start small, uh, then move. That means do. Okay, yeah, I forgot already. So just now, the record price for the last HDB one is 26 July. So four days later, uh, another record price. And in these four days, we have two record price, yeah, double. Eh. First one, executive Amokyo, 1.3 million. The second one, first five room Bukit Bato sold for 1 million. Standing ovation, ah. oh, Bukit Bato people, Bukit Bato Nians. Let me ask you, a very common sense question. Will this first five room Boogie Bato at 1 million be the last one? Or will there have more? If you think that there are more $1 million HDB flat in Boogie Bato, what it means to the rest of the property market? It will continue to go up. Lah. Just like Sengkang, just now I shared, uh, it's a second million dollar flat in Sengkang. Uh, because the first one is also this year, I think. I forgot it. Uh, go and look at my previous video. Now let's summarize, put everything on the timeline and let's observe together where are the million dollar estates. I remember this 2nd July, Tampines, then we have this, 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 that, that, this, that, this. Ah, the last one, which is this one, Amokyo Executive 1.3 million at 30th July. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. In 30 days, we have 12 record prizes. Wow, amazing, man. Actually, yeah, I don't care about all these. Uh. The more amazing thing is what you will do for your portfolio next. That's more exciting. Lah, uh. Instead of looking at people buy million dollar flat, million dollar flat. So if you want all these million dollar flat to affect your life, do something with your portfolio, which is to sell your HDB and buy a million dollar flat. No la, go and sell by condo la. If you sell flat, buy flat la, you unsubscribe ba. This is a Huawei channel, just want to remind you. This is a fun update for HDB flats and how you affect like condo prices and definitely lender prices as well. So I hope everyone will start somewhere, just plan, just get things done and move la. So for those people who already have two condos, I'm very happy for you. You may want to upgrade further. If not, having two condos is very good already. Lah. Continue to get yourself educated and see you in my next video. <laughs>